2.7. Explain the production of eddy currents in terms of Lenz's law. We need to refer to this diagram when we're describing this, this um, silver stop point. So consider a falling magnet falling through an aluminium cylinder as shown in the diagram. The moving magnetic field due to the falling magnet will induce a current in the cylinder to oppose the fall. So the magnet's falling and a current is opposing that due to the induced current. And this is Lenz's law. That is, the force on the falling magnet due to the induced current must be upwards, so it opposes it. Okay. By Orsted's rule, the direction of the induced current will be as shown anti-clockwise around the cylinder when viewed above. So this is for it to oppose the falling uh, magnet. So if you dropped a magnet through a copper tube, you'll notice the magnet slowly falls down due to Orsted's rule, which is the anti-clockwise induced current or the eddy currents opposing that fall. So it slows it down.